Hey guys, welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. We're here at um, some Tanakh settlement in the desert. Don't know what the name is yet. Um, the base is just right there, so we're quite near to that. And it says that we have a new quest here, so let's see what that's about. If we can find the way in. Okay, there we go. Arrowhand, cool. So another offshoot of um, Scalding Spear, I imagine, with the Desert Clan. But uh, more supplies to buy, so let's see. We'll do this first. The real battle is arguing with you. Look, we don't get those hearts, we don't get water, and everyone dies. What's going on? <sighs> I'm going back to the pens. I'll gut those machines myself. So machines did this? An Easterner with a hair like blood. The Outlander from the Embassy. I like that they refer to her as hair like blood. She's, he's not the first to do that. He was one of ours. It's oh. Aloy, and I'm not looking for any trouble. Well, maybe I could use some trouble right about now. Out there is a big herd my people harvest. We take the machine's hearts, send them to our capital, get paid with water. It gets harder every year. Killer machines keep showing up to defend the herd. Last one hit us right as we were penning up our prey. Nearly wiped us out. But our quarry is still in the pens, which means if I can get their hearts, we can trade for the water we need. If you go out there alone, you'll probably wind up dead, Draka. I'm not going alone, Chaplain. The great champion killer is coming with me. I mean, how about you answer some questions first? Yeah, we never agreed to that, but. Okay, lots of questions. What can you tell me about this herd? Been there for years. We harvest the parts we need from it. No more, no less. New machines always show up to replace our kills. Yep, cauldrons what will about do that. The killer machines you mentioned? They guard the herd. The more we take out, the more arrive. First sawtooths, then ravagers. Now, a sandblasted Thunderjaw hit us right as we were herding machines into our pens. Are we gonna fight a Thunderjaw? My hunters behind it ended off. Only survivors are the ones you see here. I haven't fought one yet. Also, he mentioned sawtooths. I don't think they made it into the game, unless I just haven't run into one yet. You mentioned the capital gives you water. There's no giving. We pay tribute for it with machine parts. Hearts being the most valuable. Every other desert village has some resource to exchange. But the capital of Scalding Spear is the only one with a constant supply of water. Here in dry country, it's the same as holding everyone's lives in their hands. It is the way of the desert. How we've always survived. Yeah. Okay. He seems, uh... Doesn't sound like you like this commander of yours. Yeah. Survival in the desert requires a more disciplined approach than that of other clans. It means she really likes her rules and order. <laughs> but you don't. I just don't like hers. This is insubordination. Well, I must be dehydrated. <laughs> I heard him calling you chaplain. What does that mean? It means I've survived our youth and outlived my brethren in many battles. As such, I counsel the desert clan. Those who reach my age are meant to share our wisdom with the young. Keep them on the true warrior's path when their stubbornness kicks up dust and clouds it. <laughs> you knew Regala's champion, Gruda. He was one of ours. So was Regala. Desert clan's pride and joy. I forget Why if we knew that. Why is she attacking her own people? She feels betrayed. Regala was a legend among our clan. Fearless and unrelenting. A marshal to Hikaru, chief of all Tanakh. His judgment made flesh. What changed? The Karja king asked for peace, and Hikaru agreed. Regala wanted payment in kind for the atrocities the Karja committed. A Tanakh empire that would push into the east. So she challenged Hikaru's decision. He had no choice but to face her in combat. Hikaru won. She should have died by his hand then, but the chief let her live. For Tanakh, that kind of mercy is a bitter drink. Mm. Now that she rides machines and murders marshals, we might not be able to ignore her camps in the desert for much longer. No one in the desert clans touching those camps. This is between Regala and Hikaru. Well, if the chief's trying I am. to lead, he'll prevail. If he doesn't, he'll make way for one who is. That's a little harsh, isn't it? 
So is the desert. Not wrong. Okay, I'll let's go hunt some machines. machines if I can. Probably better if you don't do it on your own. Seems like your village needs you right now. I like her. An outlander after my own heart. We can leave now, or I can meet you at our outpost southeast of here. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I'll go with you. Very well. We leave for the southeast canyon. May the Ten protect you, then. I'll await your return and report to the capital. You do that. The Ten. That's not the first time we Wait, hear mention of the Ten. Machine hearts, the faster we'll get the water we need. I think, um, in the Can't last episode. Outlander would lend us a hand when our own clan won't. <laughs> and Jataka has the stones to tell me. The commander has good reason to be strict with our water supply. You think she doesn't? I think she's always talking about how scarce water is in the desert. But do you really think anyone in Scalding Spear is dying of thirst? Or her own squad? No. I bet they dip their hand in the trough whenever they want. Our clan should be led by someone who knows what it's like to scrape by. To fight, tooth and nail, to survive. And I'm guessing that someone is you? <laughs> I've lived in the fringes of the desert my entire life. I've fought for every single mouthful of water I've ever had. I know I'm a better fighter. And I'm prettier. Ha, <laughs> I like him. Uh -huh. I'd make sure everyone gets all the water they need, no matter what village they're from. Didn't Jataka say you guys have too little to go around to begin with? I'm sure I'll be able to fix that somehow. There's always a way. I guess that's a good way to look at things. There it is. Gotta get some more ammo. Follow me. Oh, hey, this is where I, uh, I grinded here for like an you hour know, uh, trying to get Bellabacks. Our soldiers use this place to prepare themselves before herding machines into the canyon. You're uh, welcome to any supplies you can find. So Might what are we doing? Ahead. Thanks. I was going to say before we started talking, um, they mentioned the Ten in the Grove or something. Um, people that the Tanakh worship. We'll find out more, I'm sure. There we go. Let's move out. So, what's Anora looking for out in the Forbidden West? He says I'm looking for something. I doubt you traveled all the way out here just for the scenery. I'm trying to fix something. <laughs> I see. All right, you can keep your secrets. Guess I should just be thankful you decide my problems are worth fixing too. Oh, this place. I ran by here like a million years ago and I was like, well, yeah, this is for a quest. <laughs> Don't know what it's for, We're but here. okay. And how do they know so much about Nora? You'd think other than maybe like Rost, there would never have been a Nora in Tanakh territory ever. I'll help you harvest machine hearts if it'll get water for your people. Oh, we will. That's the canyon we draw machines into. Then we block them in and pick them off. Now, we'll have to climb over the barricade to get in. When we do, be ready to fight. I already lost good people in there. Can't wait to see the champion killer in action. You go and I'll follow. I like his armor. It took me a bit of time to warm up to the Tanakh armor, later. but I'm I'm really enjoying it. Okay. So what are we gonna kill? Let's see. I don't think we're gonna do a Thunderjaw, sadly. Oh, it's Ravagers. Okay. A Fanghorn, it looks like. No Apex guys, so that's good. Well, let's get a cannon. Oh, actually, since we're gonna do that. Um, I was on the fence about heavy weapon damage, but I think it'll be relevant right now, so. Cool. Is that a trap? Oh, I think this is the, uh, the hunting ground music. Cool. Totally is. That's very fun. Come on. Oh, we have a plasma bolt 
blaster, bolt caster now, blaster. Um, so we can try and hit those on the back. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I hate it when that happens. Come on, let me finish him off. Shoot. That didn't work. I tried. Oh, he just got me. That, uh, that Ravager cannon didn't really do that much. I think it's because he has so much armor on. Okay, that was a lot. Let's, um, spray this guy with acid. Just to get rid of some of that armor. Oh, we should totally be using this acid. I think it does more. Okay, marginally more buildup. The draw speed on this bow is really slow. I did just get a coil for draw speed. I think we should equip it. Oh, ouch. Wasn't there a trap up here somewhere? I don't know. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Get that cannon off. Maybe. Oh, I missed. Okay, let's shred it. I really need to get a new uh, shredder gauntlet. This one's pretty good, but... I really enjoy the Shredder Gauntlet, it's so cool. Oh, still haven't gotten it off. Oh, shoot! Oh, I was just filling my, uh, my health pouch up. Well, that's a little embarrassing. It's fine, you saw nothing. This is our first attempt. Okay, let's actually just do uh, a mm, ranged master. Yeah. Okay. Acid will do a lot of damage. It really doesn't, though. Give us a fight worth thinking. Oh, I missed the cannon. Come on, let's get it off. Before that happens. One more should do it. Got it. really gotta get some of that armor off before we use that. It's so... not good. <laughs> okay, was that a fang horn? Go away. I don't have any, my uh, fire arrows out anymore. Other Ravager right there. Come on. There we go. Now the cannon. Let's do acid really quick.
Okay. Get that cannon off now. Well, that works. Ooh, so much is happening. Okay. Oh, he's gonna hit us. I don't want to drop this, though. Okay, just enough. One more should do it. Oh, he finished him. Okay, sure, sure. Need to attend to the dead. Make sure their tags get back to their families. If you can harvest the machine hearts, I'd be grateful. Okay. Could have been better. It's all right. Let's see. Where did we kill that guy? That's all I think me. that's, uh, yeah, that's everything. I Where is, Draca. um, Draca? Oh yeah, he's helping his dead. May the wings of the ten. The wings of the above. ten. I got the hearts. We should head back to Arrowhand. That's a song yeah. on the OST. At least now we can bag and tag these soldiers. Oh, hold on. Since you can clearly handle a bunch of angry machines, I want to go back to where the Thunderjaw hit us. We're doing There's it. More fighters there. I can't just leave them to rot. They deserve to be bagged and tagged too. Will you come with me? Lead the way. Is it part of this quest to too? Yeah, okay, let's go. <laughs> ha, he has to climb down, sucker. I wonder if uh, any more of the Tanakh have gliders. I mean, he was the one who made it, question mark? So many have to die just to get water. Did you try talking to your commander at Scalding Spear? <sighs> Please, the only thing she'll listen to is the sound of a bow being drawn. About that, wouldn't mind having yours on my side if it ever came to it. I'm just passing through, Draka. Uh, you can't blame me for trying. <laughs> Why do I feel like that's actually going to be a quest now? <sighs> this is it. Where the Thunderjaw ripped through my squad. Okay, so no Thunderjaw? I'm sorry, Draka. They were warriors to the end. We should get started. I'll t definitely take the berries. I mean, I need them now. See, someone's alive. Find oh. The rocks. What? Speak sense, soldier. Rock breaker? Burrowers. Oh, burrowers. Okay, we can do that. Looks like we got a fight on. Oh, it's hunter killers, bro. Quite a few of them, eh? I've uh, I've decided that we're meleeing. Although they're not letting me.
No, nope, it's a thunder jaw. Okay, guys, this is our first thunder jaw. Let's go. Okay. Let's, uh, hmm. Let's do this. Uh, <laughs> I'm excited. Oh, wrong bow. Oh, I've missed him. Shoot. Are you kidding me? Great start, guys. Great start. Truly. So I never know, is that ranged or shock damage? Oh, I love this track. It's called Shoulders of, Shoulders of Giants. Makes sense. I'm actually trying to knock his shoulders off right now. Let's see. As if I missed that shot. I'm so mad. Oh, this actually might be a good use of the shredders. Let's see. Big old target. And we're far enough that we'll always catch it, basically. Unless I miss. Oh, really? Okay. Oh, shoot, shoot. Cover, I need cover. I'm out of berries after this. Ah! I'm a bit nervous. Come on, come on, hit, hit, yes! Oh, why, how did I miss that? We can use their cannons! Don't get one! I'll draw the Thunder Jaw's fire, give you some room! Come on! The discs seem to be a lot more powerful in this game. Or I'm just not used to having such low health, comparatively to... Okay. What's he weak to, by the way? Acid, I think? Oh, I missed that tail swing. Couple more. And then we'll hit it with uh, one of his disc launchers. The armor will just fall off, hopefully. Oh, I've missed this! Oh, that's a lot fewer. Yeah, only four. Okay. I mean, honestly, that's more balanced. I'm not sad about that. Okay, they mentioned Ravager Cannons, but I, mm, I don't know where they are. Quickly, quickly, quickly! Right there! 900 damage, nice. Get out of the way! Ooh, 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 ooh. Potion. <laughs> Shit! Oh my god, well I wasted that Valor Surge. Actually no, we got the Brace Shot on him, which was good. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. Gotta get that off, gotta get that off. Where's Draka? Shit. Potion, potion, potion. Whack, whack, whack. Come on. It's right in front of us. We gotta hit it. Because it's gonna hit hard. Big finisher, guys. Let's go. <laughs> that was fun. Oh my gosh. What do we get from that? Melee follow up. Cool. Ooh. Well, this will do. My heart's pounding a little bit. Check on Draka and that soldier. You can do a lot of cool trick shots with uh, Thunder Jaws. My favorite is sliding under the belly and hitting the chill water underneath. 
I'm sweating everywhere. But uh, at this stage in the game, no, we're gonna hide and just do power shots. That's. <laughs> Whew. Didn't think I was going to make it. You did good, soldier. You're going back home. Thanks to this one. You were the one who refused to leave your people behind. Uh, I know I'm racking up favors here, but uh, did you take those hearts back to Arrowhand? We'll be right behind you. Of course. Be careful. With that Thunderjaw heart in hand, we'll get all the water we need. Yeah. Thank you, Aloy. Okay, let's head back. I don't think it's too far from here. Hopefully we can get some more berries on the way back, because I'm a little bit low. Hey, speak of the devil. What's the first Thunderjaw that you fight in, uh, in Zero Dawn? I think mine was the one to the north of, uh... Oh, what's that village called? It's a village right when you get out of the sacred land. Save these for when I need it. Something light, I think. That, the low poly makes it look like a specter. Also, that's a behemoth. Whoa. That's new. <laughs> okay, almost just walked right into that. Let's, uh... I don't know. That, oh, I've used that ballista before, actually. Is there a behemoth convoy here? No. I don't really want to push our luck because we just killed a Thunderjaw and I have no healing. Let's just run! Oh god, oh god, oh god. Not my best move. Um, what's that city called? What's that city called? Something like... Or Dawn or something. Anyways. Yeah. Thunderjaws. A good time. Guaranteed or your money back. Can we get up and in from here? Not quite, it looks like. It's cool how most of these, um... Whoa! Look at the scrap pile. Most of these Tanakh settlements are built on the remains of, uh... Old World military sites. It, uh, it fits the aesthetic. Aesthetic. Okay, who are we talking to? Ah, uh, right, him. Uh, appreciate the extra pair of hands, Chaplain. You've returned. Where's Draka? Just a little late, Chaplain. Gained some extra baggage on the way back. She's got the machine hearts, including a Thunder Jaws. You should have seen this flame in the desert. Here. Something to commemorate our heroic victory. A victory indeed. Command will be relieved to hear about this. Get them to the Scalding Spear as soon as you can. And tell the commander how many had to die to get them. Hmm. Huntress, may I have a word? Rumors have made their way west. They say that in addition to your bow and spear, you have a kind of second sight. Especially for matters that have to do with the old ones. That's one way to put it. So it's true. You've done well by my clan, but our troubles may not be as easily settled as Draka believes. I think your second sight might be just what we need. What exactly is the problem? Not here. Meet me at Scalding oh. Spear. I'll explain everything. I'll see you there when I can. Good. The entire clan might depend on it. Oh, wow. Okay, so follow-up quest, it seems. Is that it for thirst of th Yeah, it is, okay. We might level up from this? Let's see. Uh, not quite. The wound in the sand. We did hear mention about that, actually. Hey, Tanakh the Vanquisher. Nice. Okay, let's uh, check out the wares for sale, and then um, call it a day. Don't know what we're going to do next. Maybe the wound in the sand. I do want to do main quest stuff, though, so, yeah. Anchor Rope Caster and Piercing Shredder Gauntlet. Okay, that's really cool. Another Quen weapon. I don't know what Quen means. Um, this one's pretty cheap. Let's get it. I never use Rope Casters. Um, 
Purge water canister harpoons sounds kind of cool. I don't know what that's all about though. Okay, cool. See, you were right to come to me. I was. Ah, strike through precision arrows. That's cool. All right, some more stuff to try out. Um, yeah, I'm going to take some time here, maybe upgrade my gear, look around, and then decide what we're going to do next. I'll see you then.